Merry Swipe Miss, ladies and gentlemen. What is up, everybody? Bringing you some more Lego deals and some news on some decent Lego sales. So if all of that sounds interesting, we're going to be going through Double Lego Insiders Weekend, basically double points on Insider Points on the Lego website, as well as looking some Lego deals. So like I said, if all of that interests you, stick around, hit that subscribe button, like today's video, and we can jump straight on into it. For those of you who are new to the channel, my name is Christo. I'm from Stud City. We like to cover Lego deals, Lego news, Lego City, Lego reviews, kind of the whole spiel. So welcome aboard if you are new. We like to swipe the card responsibly. We literally collect Lego plushies on midnight release live streams. And we just do crazy chaotic things in the Lego community. So if I didn't sell you, I don't know what will. So anyways, we've got a lot to talk about in today's video. I want to make it as short as possible for you guys, as I am thankful for you guys watching my videos. But let's jump straight on into it. First things first, like I said, earn double points on Lego Insiders. And is this a sales tactic? Absolutely from the Lego group, right? Are sales doing well during the holiday seasons? I don't know, right? I They unfortunately leave that private. Um, we're starting to see, well, we've already started to see during like the Black Friday sales, but we started seeing a ton of Lego sets go out of stock and sold out, especially for the sets that are retiring at the end of the year. And truthfully, that showcases a lot of the very popular Lego sets. But um, we're kind of in the scraps section, get what you can, because it's kind of a last call as we're nearing the end of the December. So I feel like this is a nice little sale for any of you holding out on maybe a last opportunity to pick something up that's even still available. So it's going to kick off here tomorrow on uh, December 8th all the way until December 12th. So that is pretty exciting, guys. We're going to get essentially four days of opportunity to get double insider points, which again, for those of you who don't know, the Lego Insider program is essentially maybe 5% in rewards points back onto your account. Um, it is not cash. You have to actually spend it on Lego uh, or redeemable rewards or dollars towards another Lego set, but essentially it's all going towards Lego, right? So Keep that in mind. Double points just means double times 5%. So essentially, it's a 10% kind of cashback reward system. It's pretty nice. Um, again, that's going all the way from Friday, December 8th, all the way to the 12th. Now, fortunate for us, we are also available to stack this with two promotional items that are still in stock. A little surprised these days in stock just because of the holiday season. Like I said, I was pretty expecting these to go sold out within maybe like the fourth four or five days since they went live on December 1st, but it looks like we're still available to get them. One is going to be the wintertime carriage ride gift, and the other one is the Lego Christmas decor gift. I think these are great promos. You only have to spend $150 to essentially lock in both of these. So if you locked in both of these and got 10% in cashback, plus used your, your good friends at Rakuten for additional cashback, it's a nice little sale. For those of you who are new, Rocketon's a cashback program. They're great. Um, link in the description if you want to join that. But anyways, not the focus point of today's video. Um, essentially, it's, it's just a nice little sale on top of, you know, retiring soon Lego sets. Unfortunately, Lego doesn't have a bunch of sales going on. Um, you can still stack these sets into, you know, spending your 150 or just you want some of these sets to get 10%, you know, in cashback. Uh, even the sets on, on sale. So like if you picked up the Scrooge McDuck, Huey, Dewey, and Louie uh, for $14.99, you would still get 10% on this $15 spent, which is essentially $1.50. So pretty nice. Um, it's really nice to see Double Insiders Weekend. I know people get really excited about it. I'm very passionate about Double Insiders Weekend. I think it's always a great time to buy. Um, and hopefully Rakuten upstairs from like 2.5% to, you know, maybe 5 to 10%. That'd be also pretty nice so a bunch of really cool sets actually on sale a lot of mario a lot of brickheads they even have the lunar new year parade i'm expecting this one to not sell us very well considering um these normally don't go on sale considering they have a very short shelf life there's only like two large lunar new year sets that come out every year and they have a very relative short life because it's uh, available from january 1 and retires in december of that same year so i actually really like this one i haven't pulled the trigger yet on it so maybe i'll swipe the card and get this set during this promotion. Who knows? But for now, I'm just gonna hold out and uh, we'll, we'll see where things go. But that's pretty exciting. Um, also on the Lego page, if you go up here, there's a holiday section. They don't really have a lot of sales, but they it's nice they updated the website to like, hey, you know, here's Star Wars, Disney, gift cards, Christmas decor, stocking stuffers, and new Lego items. Uh, and then even some of the best sellers, well, I feel like the best sellers are just items that are still available in stock. They're 
have nothing to do with their sales count. I, I truly believe that. Um, considering, I mean, I, I love the Millennium Falcon Holiday Diorama. I love that set, but they clearanced it like 20% off during Black Friday. And it didn't go out like out of stock right away. I, it just stuff like that. It just throws me off. I'm like, are these really bestsellers? But that's a whole nother topic there. Uh, just kind of my personal thoughts and opinions. But anyways, like I said, I really do like the Lego page. I like that they incorporated like Christmas into it and updated it pretty significant. Um, so that is something to talk about. Uh, anyways, that's kind of the only sales on the Lego website that's currently going on. Will we get new gift with purchases or even your your Lego blankets? Um, hold out, guys. Maybe, possibly, potentially. We'll hopefully see some more promos at the end of the year. I have no idea. They have not told me anything like that yet. Um, I'm just kind of holding out, just like you guys, taking advantage of the ones that are present and uh, trying to plan out my future, right? But anyways, I also wanted to bring up a couple LEGO sales that are going on that I think are very worthwhile to mention. Whether you're a LEGO fan, Dreams fan or not, I think it's still worth to call out a couple of these. Um, I think the craziest one uh, was, it was a crazy sale. I think it was like 44% off being um maybe 44 percent off i think it's somewhere in that mark but anyways it's the lego dream stable of dream creation creatures that's 50 dollars. so you save 30 bucks off an 80 dollar set i feel like that's a decent price point it comes with 681 pieces so that 80 dollar price point for me is just astronomical that is just way too high this should probably all in all be a 65 dollar lego set probably 60 65 i would say 60 so even even if it was at 60 you know you're getting it less than that at 50 bucks i just feel like it's did decent value add uh it's just a lot of parts a very large kind of lego set for that price so that is kind of a worth a worthwhile one i think um they have a bunch of other lego dream sets on sale as well more on the rollback like 20 percent off like the crocodile from 59 to 50. Uh, i just find that hard to justify to spend 50 on this one when you get we'd get so much more for 50 on this one so just a thought there haven't really seen any sales on the shark nightmare shark ship i think that's an amazing set i bought that at release and built it same with the dreams uh oz's space bus that was an awesome one as well i know we're not a huge lego dreams fan channel but uh, i still really do like some of the sets i also picked up the mateo and z blob uh mech and i really enjoyed one that one as well now on the contrary i believe they had a couple ninjago sales and i haven't really seen ninjago go on sale throughout the entire year uh but they have like 20 percent off a couple sets here like the imperium dragon hunter hound which is nice to see finally a sale on some ninjago sets uh, again, 20% off on the J Golden Dragon set. Um, they even have, I think that's 20% off or maybe 10% off this Golden Dragon. Um, and I know they had some of the crystallized sets on sale. Let's see if we could scroll here and find them. Maybe that sale went very fast, but they did have a few of them. And I was really shocked because they were sold out on, on Lego. So I don't know, something interesting. One that I have yet to find on sale was the Destiny's Bounty, uh, the new one. I really want that one so bad but the 160 dollars price point is just absurd so we'll keep that in mind as we look for it um i thought their crystal cream mech was on sale but it's not even pulling up on the lego oh here it is yeah this bad boy went on sale discord called it out it went on sale for 48 dollars. i definitely missed it yet again it's already back at 90 bucks so unfortunately missed that one yet again uh but we'll be calling out more lego deals as we see them uh so jumping over to target really quick i know you guys like to stay update on some of these deals target really doesn't have a whole lot more than uh the 20 percent. i feel like the best one is probably the atte walker 112 bucks uh 212.99 for 113 dollars that's a pretty decent price point um and then they have other miscellaneous sets for 20 percent off like the tie bomber which is a common price we've seen uh we have the boba fett starship we have the dark trooper attack um that's just kind of on the star wars sides guys and they still do have the advent calendars even though they are sold out at lego but anyways we can talk more on lego deals in a future video for now that's going to wrap up today's video i do not have a sponsor for today's video so we are going to showcase a pokemon card from our collection and in today's video we are showcasing a uxie uxie uh really cool card i don't know i love these cards as <laughs> i love these cards as a kid but uh, if you like pokemon hit that subscribe button i like to showcase a card from my personal collection in every single video but that's gonna wrap it up i uh, love you guys make sure to hit that subscribe button like today's video and uh journey to 30k subscribers and onward to 50k we'll see you in the next one guys love you guys peace out